Assalamu alaikum, my brothers and sisters. Peace be upon you. In Islam, horoscopes and fortune telling are strictly forbidden for several important reasons. First and foremost, Islam teaches that only Allah has knowledge of the unseen, including the future. Any person reading your horoscope or telling what your future has in store for you through astrological means is claiming, in essence, to know something that only Allah can know. This definitely goes against the core Islamic belief in the Tawheed, the oneness of Allah, and falls under shirk, the gravest sin in Islam, associating partners with Allah. Such practices are strictly forbidden by the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. He stated, Whosoever goes to a soothsayer and believes in what he says has indeed denied in what has been revealed to Muhammad, Sunan Abu Dawud. It illustrates the severity of the action that it nullifies the Quranic teachings and those of the Sunnah. Another reason is that seeking guidance from horoscopes or from fortune tellers reflects a lack of faith in Allah. As Muslims, we are encouraged to have tawakkul, which means placing one's complete reliance and trust in Allah's plan. When we go to seek predictions or astrological signs to tell us what to do, it means that we are not trusting Allah with our future and that diminishes our level of faith. Horoscopes and fortune-telling further compel one to rely on superstition rather than the correct use of rational thinking and acquiring knowledge as dictated by Islam. These are the things that keep people off the clarity of Islam and mislead them. Islam has forbidden horoscopes and fortune-telling in order to protect our faith and to have trust in Allah alone so that we may be based on true knowledge and not deception and superstition. May Allah guide us and strengthen our iman. Thanks for watching. If this video taught you anything, please drop us a like and comment below.